Deliverance from all fears. There are things that you are afraid of. And there are things you are not afraid of. There are people you are afraid of. There are people you are not afraid of. So your fears are your nightmares. Your nightmares are there to torment you. The level of how you seek him determines the level of your deliverance from fear. 2 Timothy 1 verse 7. Fear there is a spirit. And this spirit is not from God. It's a spirit from Satan. Satan. Can you see we are talking about spirits here? And those spirits are there to affect us negatively. A spirit is there to lead you. A spirit is there to direct you. So if you are directed by a spirit of fear, it means you always live to escape. You, you live to escape. You're not living your life. You live a life of running away. You live a life of hiding. One of the reasons why we have fear is we are trying to live a life that other people are living. Copying how other people live can make you to live a life of fear. We can learn a life of deliverance from all fears. When we begin to understand how God works, if we understand that how God works, we allow things to happen and whatever happens for good, we won't have fear. I don't know if you're hearing me. Fear that. is leading people. As much as the Holy Spirit leads people, the decisions making can, can be so contrary to what God wants you to do. Things that are coming because of that to bring fear. If God is for us, we will tell those things we don't mind. The moment when you realize that, oh, God is the ultimate, there's still life after all these things. All these things. There's still God. There's still you and God. All these things cannot separate you with him. But the problem is we are trying to get these things to ourselves. That when we lose them, we feel like life is finished. But as there's still life after all these things. I don't know. Here, here, here. Can you tell anybody there is still life after your money after your car after your marriage there is still life but now the, what makes you to have fear because you are trying to, to, to bring some attachments. You, how can you be delivered from fear just read that verse First John. Johanna Wapili. 
chapter 4 verse 18 yes you, you are free to lose your job fear is a great weapon that devil will use uchaba kishimisha sese hulu sese satana za sebe dikisa mafililu mara hao lukuli nchikara uchaba we want to we want to do this to you say no 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 if fear from god how chaba utamu dimu cannot overcome fear usa from satan uhlula go chaba utha u satan you are going to misbehave au wa le todi ya ka mogose ngwa i don't know if you are hearing me. Uh, look at azef 21 verse 3 how can people know that is the lord god who is doing something for you but to ba tatsi ba jong re ke more na modimo ya di yang diloche o wena is when now you have passed a stage ke re wena o fitile siem of fear so chaba fear makes you to find some other chaba o dia ore o tholeng litsela na tshe dingwe try to help yourself o leka o and makes you to disobey god ya dira o ro ska to modimo for god to do it his Uri, way modimo a ta bereke ka tsela ya overcome fear ngo thomo tlhole o chaba if we are afraid so long are le ba o chaba of suffering re chaba di taisho challenges di challenge ja bophilo people will never know is god but ba ka sitse e bore modimo wa shoma fear makes you to sin wa bona go chaba o ta dia ro dia ro di di phoso di re sin fear makes you to disobey god o dira ro se ka thona o ita modimo disobedience bring you to a, to be a sinner o sa ta modimo di re wena vho mo etsa dibi many people who are who are doing wrong things but ba ntshi ba di yang di phoso tshe di mpi they were try to adjust their lives ne ba le ka upya ba ya ka ntsha ba philo wa bona and when they are busy try to do like ba le ka le tshora mola le mola le mola ba ba tsena sebe later they found themselves in ka mora ona ba ti thola ba tsene ka ra sebe he who is having fear ye na ye o ya nang le go tshaba when he progress ha tshela pele he does show off o ndia di show off ntwela ba re mpone pride and tasi we go go mosha wa tsena because he want to show other people that they cannot reach where he is ka re unyo ko bontsha ba ngwe mo na ke leng le ka sefite o chaba re ba bangwe ba tata ba mo challenge is afraid of being challenged o chaba o challenge you so today you'll be delivered out of fear le gone re tan lokollwa ka ra o chaba when you start to see someone coming with a new car you are afraid ha o thoma bona motho wa ngwa tsela ka gore ya ba o tele jwa gore motho wa nand pita mo tsele a mo gela ka mo go motima o file and god of mercy will see a motima di ga o gela o ta o tswele fear makes you to do things o chaba o ta o dirisa dilo in a way that you want to prove to someone that is smaller than you motho mongwe le o monnyane go wena philippians 4 verse 6 and 7 ba philippi 4 6 le 7 if there's no need for fear ha o se na bo tshitoko sa re re tshabe what will happen to you is ntwe to di ala ngwe na se ha wena o sabila e le silo what will happen there will be peace ntwe ta di ala ngwe to no ba le khutjo that peace guys you khutjo ye lana ya o hlata those challenges will come the challenge to we di ata di lebele tshi business ye na ye o i don't know if you hear it i can say ba le ntle le ntwa so no tshele jang ta ba shi don't be anxious o se ka bilela ne don't be distracted o se ka shitelwa nne don't allow fear o se ka dumella o chaba to rule you how do you know you have got o se ba ba o rona le khutjo ka gare le se sengwe is when you stand on what you said whether you are challenged or not mo la mantshi go a boletse go ona wena o challenge o ba awa so the problem we have here is bo tata bo nang le bona mo asebo is when now things start to be funny ke di lo di thomo ba ka mogwanyana o mongwe ask i was where are you going right but sure can't hear a guy let's look at this verse are le beleng verse 6 verse 13 verse 6 by bero 13 6 we are not afraid of circumstances au chabi di emo we are not afraid of what people will do are chabo re batho ba tata ba dia because the one who help us is god ka o ba ni ya re thushang ke modi for god to begin to work in your life. Ore motimo ba te ba thoma o shuma ka re bo phelo jwa lena. It doesn't just happen automatically. Ta ba ya ona e no thalla fela fela nne. The people you trust. Ba tho ba lo ba tshepileng. The people you are expecting. Ba lo ba lebeletsing. To do something they have to leave you. Ore ba o di ele se sengwe ba tshontjo no utuela. So that you must not check the help from them. Ore o se ka lebella thusho re ta tha o bona. You will check the help from God. O lebella re thusha ta tha mo re neng. I don't know if you are hearing. I get seven in to. If you are hearing say I hear. Ha le nto re nke atwa. When the Lord is your helper. Ha mo re na le ena motho shi wawo. You won't even fear people. E bele le batho ka se ba tshabo ka se ba boife. When God want to help you. Ha mo di mwanya ko o thusha yena. He doesn't want anybody to hit his chest. Ha nya ko re motho a ta isha pedigara. 
Because where he is taking is not where they are going. Many have to die in the desert. And your destiny is assured. I'm here to tell you your destiny is assured. What God said, it will come to pass. Don't have fear of losing a family. Losing Losing anybody. Let them leave you. For God to be revealed. When they leave you, God will start to manifest. The Lord God will be visible. And the hand of God will be clear. But if you have fear, you will compromise your strength. And you will speak your doubts. You won't see any victory. Oh, kasi bonetu.